Hi everyone, it's Jojo from Mojo Jojo Plant, and today I am planning some more daily sheets for my daily planner, which I usually just help narrow things down each day so I'm not super overwhelmed. Um, I am going in with my printables. They are available on my website. I'll have it linked down in the description below. And then we're continuing with using some older Happy Planner sticker books. So today I have Happy and Hungry, Ingrid Blooms in the big size, Funky Abstracts, Golden Black, and Graceful Heart. Um, I feel like this week will be a little bit easier because we have a lot of books that are good for decorating um so i think overall this should be a pretty simple week i'm hoping <laughs> let's get started okay so i have gold and black so this is gonna be all like my neutral vibes yes oh yeah that's right i forgot this had like glitter had some glitter vibes in it well let's pull that out before i forget why not Started off with some glitter over there. Ooh, I got a square. That's perfect. I use this little corner down here to like track stats for like social media things. Um, we have a full box for decoration. And then we also have a full box with the glitter. I like the idea of pulling in more of the glitter. I am going to see if there's some other options before I grab another one. Um, kind of, not really. So let's grab this one. We'll stick that right in there. And then I just need to see, so I don't have a ton of things that I could fill in. I mean, there's some decoration things, but there's not a lot. So I think I'm actually going to use one of these big double wide um, stickers. And then we can decorate around it because there is some, um, I don't know what these are called. I can find them. Uh, where'd they go? There they are. We have these things. I don't know what you would call these, but... <laughs> you can kind of use these to fill in some white spaces. Just put a little bit here and there. Maybe. No. I also put lotion on my hands before this, which was not a good idea. My hands were like painfully dry. <laughs> but that was not a good idea because now I'm having a really hard time grabbing stickers. That was my bad. Okay, I did see some smaller functional boxes. But we do have a priority sticker. So I'm going to change that just so it all matches. And I'm also going to change this to do into important, just more important things to get done. Um. I did see smaller ones. I know I'm not making that up. Except they all have something written in them. Which is kind of annoying. So I'm actually going to take my scissors. And I'm going to cut the meeting off. But just enough so I still have like the border on the box. Because I don't need the meeting. But I want the box. <laughs> So I'm going to do the same thing with this gray one. I'm just cutting right underneath the words. That way it still gives me a little bit of that box border. And I can do a little bit of layering. Which I like to have. And then again, just going to add in some more glitter because why not? I think that's good. Gold and black have a little bit of everything. There were quotes in there, but I don't really have space for quotes, so I don't think we need that this time around. We're going to go into a horizontal. Oops, that's the wrong side. And I did set aside funky abstracts and Ingard blooms because I feel like I could use either one of those pretty easily um, in this horizontal, mainly because I had like these. So I was like, I feel like I could make it work. And there's those. This has like a lot of fun stuff in it. I don't even know where to start. 
Wow, I forgot this had some really good stuff in it. Oh no, I'm conflicted now. No, I don't know what I want. Okay, well let's use these because these are kind of fun. I'm going to use at least one of them. And I'm going to lay that in the center. And then I did see some blank boxes. So I'm going to kind of just make my own new layout basically with these. So I'm kind of changing the layout a little bit. They are a little bit shorter. But the nice thing is that these are light gray, so the line doesn't bother me as much. Again, kind of just laying that down, making my own layout. I could have used one that had a... Um, quote in it for that middle one but that's okay I really like this you were made for this I just don't know where I'm gonna put it yet I'm gonna set it aside for a second because I don't know where I want it I'm gonna add a couple extra boxes I really like just using these as like a um like a header like usually I'll put film and then I'll write what I'm filming like in the rest of it so I kind of really just like using these as like a little header just makes it look a little nicer, I think. I don't think there are any washi strip pieces, like kind of, but not, not the long ones that we're used to. So I'm gonna put this up here. You were made for this. We have quotes. This book really has a little bit of everything, which is nice. I feel like, because we're getting, we're in the 400s for the books, so I think we're getting to an area where there was just a little bit more of everything in all the books, as opposed to, you know, each one only specialized. Oh my gosh, what happened? <laughs> it like ripped perfectly. Why? I don't even know how that happened. It was like pre-cut or something. Okay, I'm going to put this here, and then we're going to just attach this and act like that never happened. If I can figure out where it goes, right here. Okay. We're good. <laughs> I was like, I don't even know how that happened. Okay, and then we have all of these, like decorative pieces which are kind of fun but they're also really really big so like that's my only thing with this one is we have fun decorations but they're huge so just got to kind of keep that in mind when it comes to decorating that there I need something for I saw squares but I don't oh no just kidding. I didn't see a square though that is just like a quote square, if that makes sense. All of these kind of have little prompts, which maybe a little prompt isn't a bad idea. Dreaming about. Put a little dreaming about sticker in there. And again, there's lots of decorations. I'm just like, they're so big that I kind of don't really want to add them. They are definitely bigger. We have top three. And then I'll do today's list over here. Okay, I think that's good. Funky abstracts. Set that aside. Flip this page over. And now we're going to try doing Ingrid Blooms, which this one I do not think has a lot of... I mean, it has a lot of decoration, but as far as functional stuff, it does not really have any. We have like little bits and pieces here and there. So I think I'm going to have to get some help <laughs> for this one because this one just does not have a lot to it. Hmm. 
a lot of the colors I'm seeing are like brighter colors so I'm just gonna pull this book out because it has a lot of bright colors in it and we'll just stick to that bright theme These aren't going to fill the entire box, but that's what I'll use other boxes for, so I'm not super worried about it. So I'm going to stick these in here. Stick this one down here. Just grabbing all of these, apparently. I just want all the colors. And then I'm going to go in. This is just... Um, summer boxes, if I have any boxes, <laughs> uh, okay, we have some yellow, pull some of that in, it'll kind of cover up those areas that are open. Just to add a little bit more color in here. I'll bring in a little bit of red. I don't really have a lot of pink. Okay, this book is a little bit harder. <laughs> Underestimated. This one, it just has like, it has a lot of decoration, but it really doesn't have a lot of functional stuff, which is interesting. I don't think I've ever used one of those, so I know they're supposed to go in a box, but I don't have any boxes anymore. <laughs> um, okay, and this one I don't think has, um, I don't think this one has quotes either. I actually might pull out black and gold because this book does have gold accent stuff in it which could work. So I think I might pull out some of like the gold accent stuff from the black and gold book. Got this. I know there were some quotes in here. I've just got to find them. If I could pull them up. Every day is a fresh start, and then I'm thinking something up here. Stay close to what makes you feel. Alive. Okay, I think that's good. That one, yeah, Ingrid Blooms does not have a lot. It has a lot of really pretty, like, decorations, but not a lot of functional, which is okay. Okay, next one, we are going into back to vertical. Um, let's do Graceful Heart. Ugh, the hollow in here. I love this book. It's just, like, bright and happy and colorful. And it makes me happy and it has hollow in it but I keep hoarding the hollow because it's such a pain in the butt to take pictures of but maybe to like you know what I think I'm gonna use a little bit of hollow today let's do it what the hey I'm gonna use this piece sorry it's gonna blind you a little bit I use this piece as my little border here all the colors in here. Oops, circles. A nice big quote and then I'll put some of that hollow around it. I'm going to stick to the brighter boxes I think. 
I don't think there were any full boxes that had a quote in it. Now that I'm thinking about it. But maybe we can make one. So I'm actually going to oops, just rip that page out. Why don't I? I'm going to stick this right in here. And then I'm going to take one of these. And layer it and kind of just make my own quote, which I know you can't really see because of the hollow. But look how pretty. I love hollow. <laughs> Makes me so happy. Okay, I do want to add more hollow. Like if we're going to do it, we might as well. Might as well do it. So I just want to add some more of those sparkles on there. Which again, I know on camera are not the easiest to see. This one actually doesn't have like a lot of, it has a lot of bright colors, but it doesn't have a lot of things to actually decorate with, which is really interesting. It has a lot, that's gonna be for my header. It has a lot of fun colors. There's like no, like I feel like paint splashes or like there's these, but they're half circles. And I don't know. I guess I have a hard time using half circles for decorating. Let's try it. <laughs> Maybe it helps that they're white. But I kind of wish they were just like regular paint splashes instead of half circles. Because then I can't... It makes it a little harder to put them wherever I want them to be. We'll still make it work. Um... That hollow is bright though. <laughs> Sorry. It's definitely bright. But yeah, it's so interesting that this is like filled with color, but it really doesn't have a lot of other decorative things, which I find so interesting. I'm just going to add more hollow so when you look at the page, kind of all glimmers. Okay, well that is Graceful Heart. We have one more to do. We're going to flip that over. And this time it's Happy and Hungry, which this is such a cute book. But it's definitely <laughs> different from what I would put in here. But we're going to try it and see what happens. Um, I guess i got to figure out what I want in the center. I just like love this one. <laughs> it's just funny. I think it's hilarious. Okay, well we're gonna put a couple of these little boxes. I did see a full box. I just I'm trying to decide which one I want, so can't commit to that just yet. But I did see some more functional. I almost said functionable. <laughs> I don't know why. Functional boxes. Functional. There we go. Functional boxes. Um, we have, we can use one of these. Probably should do another check in down here. And then maybe we can find something to fill in that corner. Use that as a corner piece. Um, okay, I'm trying to decide <laughs> what I want to use, um, like for the full box, because there's a couple ones that I love, but I'm like, do I want to use it in here? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what I want. Okay, I'm gonna use this one. You are the avocado to my toast. It's just cute. Oh, that's a shorter one. I don't want that one. I want the long one. I thought that one was the long one, so my bad. 
that in there. I have pink down at the bottom, so that's why I was like, we'll just do that one. Okay, I need something for this center area. There's decorations in here, but again, they're like teeny tiny. I think there's some double wide, unless I use them all, which I might have. There is, but okay, so there's not really, I don't really have any more. Okay, well, let's take this. I'm going to take this, and then we're going to take this so I can layer, and then we can kind of just go in with some of the food. We've got some cute sushi, just going to put all over, just have all the kinds of food. Okay, this one we have tacos. burger pizza which is my fave a little egg oh my gosh this little bagel so cute if I can get it at maybe it's not cute okay there we go I got it in this little piece of toast and a croissant and a donut what else do we have we have a little cake uh, I'm assuming this is like coffee or something that's what it looks like to me another like little cake thing can never have too much cake sorry it's not in frame and a cookie and a macaroon is it macaroon or macaron macaron I don't know Never gonna say it right. <laughs> and a little ice cream cone. Kind of just like getting all the things in here, because why not? Um, I don't think that was it. There's fruits and stuff at the back. I don't think there's any more in the center. Those ones don't have faces, so we won't do those. Um, I just want a raspberry and grapes, maybe. And then maybe we can call it good raspberry and grapes okay i think that's it <laughs> all right let me go ahead and get these punched so we can take a look at all of our pages Alrighty, so we have page one page two page three page four in its hollow glory and then page five which i think i like page five but maybe it's just because it has so much stuff on it it just like makes it look more fun I don't know. I think the neutral ones are kind of throwing me off, but other than that, I love them. So there we go, you guys. I so hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give a thumbs up and subscribe, and I hope I'll see you in my next one. Bye!